Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Dobbs here, bringing you guys my first NHL 15 Hockey Ultimate Team video. That is right guys. Starting off with a bang here. Not quite sure, I don't even know what I'm going to be calling this series myself, but I'm just going to go along with it. Once the time, once you guys are watching this video, you guys will know the series name. I'm trying to think of a lot of names for this series, but I'm not quite sure what to name it yet. But we're going to go with Blame Dobbs Hockey Club as our team name for NHL 15. Um, <laughs> we, a lot of people on Twitter uh, like that ha uh, hashtag and it got around so a lot of people wanted it and I just thought to do it you know I, I really couldn't think of an ultimate team name I just went with that, I guess. It's pretty funny, and it's it's funny to see it in the crowds when they lift up my um when they lift up those signs, and it says like "Blame Dobbs HC" and all that. It's pretty funny, but um yeah, guys, this is my hockey ultimate team series. I, th what this series is gonna be? It's not gonna be pack hunters. Um, I'm gonna kind of leave it up to you guys. But what I'm gonna be doing from right now is um obviously showing you guys my team, opening packs, and then going on to some gameplay that I didn't normally do in 14. And um, I kind of feel like I lack there, and I want to add some more gameplay to my channel, not just the packs. Um, I did add ESHL versus GM modes, all of that. I'm not saying that, but. Hockey Ultimate Team wise, I didn't record so much gameplay wise, and that's what I really wanted to add, and that's why I wanted a brand new series. So, should I keep pack hunters, guys? Do you guys want to see pack hunters for the 360? Because I'm going to be opening up packs on the 360 and the Xbox One. Currently, you guys are watching the packs being opened on the Xbox One version. They obviously look better and all that, but I also get packs on the 360. So, let me know if you guys want me to keep pack hunters around. That's basically what got me started. I don't think I can just like push it to the side never go back to it again I think I want to do it for the 360 and then do my road to glory kind of series on the Xbox one That's not what the name's gonna be. I'm gonna have something different, but you know like a road to race to division one road to division one all those names that you guys probably seen a hundred times um, I want to come up with something a little different. It's not a knock to anyone who has those series names. It's it gets the views, you know, and that's what they want, and that's understandable. But I just wanna, I wanna come up with a brand new name for my hut series, and I'm gonna be including pack openings. I'm gonna be including like me buying new players and stuff like that. Um, and what to, like. What do you guys want to see? Let me know. Honestly, I want to hear what you guys want to see because ultimately, at the end of the day, you guys are the one watching. You guys are the ones watching my videos. So please, guys, let me know anything. Let me know, guys, in the comment section below what you guys want to see from this hot series because I really, really want to take on a bit more seriously this year um i played a lot of gm mode and a lot of ashl and that's gonna stay that's obviously gonna stay i want to add a lot more club uh to my channel so i want really want to focus on uh, hockey ultimate team for the xbox one and ashl for the 360 so please guys let me know like i said i'm not gonna say it again but let me know if you guys have any suggestions in the comment section below now to the packs we haven't been getting anything too special these are just like the free packs we we get you can't trade them or anything like that a uh, couple mid 80s couple uh, high 70s nothing too special i mean we got jordan nolan and stuff like that just a bunch of grinders and stuff it's just nothing special the free packs aren't good uh if you guys have opened your free packs let me know what you've pulled in those um current i don't think i've pulled anything too good i think my best pull is um Oh, I can't remember. It was like 85 or something like that. It, it's nothing too special, but, you know, I can't really say anything too much because it's obviously free. So, uh, yeah, I'm also going to be uh, showing you guys some gameplay. This is going to be my first hot game uh, coming up right after these packs, guys. But let me, I would just want to let, like, leave it up to you guys. I don't know what to call this series. I don't know how long you guys want the episodes. I was kind of thinking around the 10-minute mark, maybe, if I'm going to be including gameplay in these um in these episodes i was thinking around the 10 to 12 minute mark uh let me know what you guys think i mean i could even cut it down to eight but i just don't know about length wise and i really want to find that out so let me know what works for you guys in the comments below and um, i've been having a lot of fun with hl 15 lately i've been doing very well i'm not gonna jinx it or anything like that knock on wood but um yeah i'm really enjoying this game i mean obviously there's a couple touch-ups that they need to address and that goes with their 
every game, obviously, right? And they've all they've already addressed it. They're going to be coming up with patches and stuff like that to add game modes. And I'm really excited for NHL this year. So I can't wait. And I want to keep my focus on a hockey ultimate team and ESHL as much as possible. So um, I think we've opened all our packs, guys. I'm going to cut it here and I'll be commentating over the gameplay. So I'll see you guys in just a moment guys I'm back so I don't really have a set topic to talk about in this video I'm probably gonna be rambling on about a, a lot of things and then in the upcoming episodes I'll be talking more about the gameplay and stuff like that but just since this is episode one I just want to talk to you guys ask you guys what you think about this series if you guys have any input and that type of stuff right just to get that all of the way just to see if I could do anything better to improve my videos and just stuff like that right I just want to hear from you guys I haven't really uploaded a video in quite a while aside from the couple NHL 15 demo videos I upload I haven't been uploading too much and uh, the reason why is because I have finally got a job. I know it's been way too damn long, but um, I've got a job. I'm working full time and I have, it's really, really hard to find time to make videos and luckily I could make them today. So um, whenever I have the chance to, I really do want to put, uh, put out content. But then again, you guys have to understand that I don't want to rush content or force content or do anything like that um, just for the sake of putting out a video. So you guys, I don't want to like force onto you guys but you got hopefully you guys understand that and I just want to produce the best quality content I can so um, I'm gonna I think I will have like three days where I can just completely commentate uh, you know record do all that and then um, I can schedule my videos throughout the week so I think that's gonna work th uh, work for me I just got to find um, the right schedule and stuff like that I just got to work around um, all the other stuff that's coming up in life and uh, god damn it man school and all that stuff uh, for everyone it's just it's crazy it's a crazy time of the year and I just got figure all that out and once it gets flowing I'll have a set schedule and all that and you guys will still see the same videos at the same rate as you saw them last year just I'm just going to be approaching it in a different manner. So hopefully you guys understand that. And like I said, I want to always put out the best content for you guys. I don't want to rush a video just for the sake of rushing a video. It just doesn't make sense to me because YouTube I started. Um, I'm now I'm kind of going off now. But I started YouTube as a hobby and just to enjoy it and put out the best content as I possibly can. So why just rush it, right? Um, but enough of that. NHL 15. Let's talk about that now. Let's actually talk about some NHL 15. My first impressions... I don't know if I'm going to make a first impressions video, but, um, you know what? Fuck it. Let's just talk about it now. First impressions. All right. So I'm not even going to bother making a video about that. Probably a lot of people have done it already, so I'm not even going to bother... But this game feels really solid. I'm not going to lie. I was absolutely blown away from the presentation. And I'm extremely happy. Graphic wise for the Xbox One. It is. Well, it's really nice. It's a nice. It's just refreshing. It's just a good change. You know. This is the first NHL on the next generation consoles. I, and see that's another thing. I shouldn't say next gen generation. Because we're playing them right now. I gotta say. Current generation. Just X. Xbox One, PS4, god damn it. Um, but uh, yeah, they look phenomenal. I'm very, very happy uh, presentation wise what EA has done to the game. Um, see, I haven't played the 360 version. I own it, but I haven't got to playing it. So hopefully I can get that going soon. And um, that brings up another thing. Uh, for Hockey Twin Team Pack Hunters, guys, uh, should I just record that on the 360 and then do my hut, like, adventure fucking road to glory? series whatever you want to call it. i'm not even quite sure i'm going to be calling this yet uh but like should i just do my actual hot series on xbox one that with packs and all that and then just do um pack hunters on the 360 let me go let me know in the comments guys honestly i really i don't want to just brush away from pack hunters because that's basically where i started at right it was uh pack hunters uh videos and i really want to continue in nhl 15 so let me know i'll be opening a ton of packs in nhl 15 as well um, because I have I think it you get two packs every week on the Xbox one and then two packs every week on the 360 and on top of that the coins and all that to buy the um to buy the packs, so I'm going to be opening up a ton of packs this year, uh, but I really want to cut down on the Microsoft points on that. I want to try to earn legit, so that's why I want to do this series, right? So 
Um, I'm really looking forward to it this year. Those are my plans, hut wise, ESHL and all that. That'll be coming shortly. GM mode, all that uh, type of stuff. Uh, is going to be coming very shortly as well. I've already picked a team. I did the voting on Twitter. Uh, I came down to the Tampa Bay. I was uh, I was considering just not even telling you guys, but it came down to the Tampa Bay Lightning and the Toronto Maple Leafs. We'll find out uh, very shortly what team I've picked, and we'll go from there. I think I want to record uh, my GM mode series on the 360 because a lot of people are complaining about the uh, Xbox One GM mode version. So I think I'm going to steer clear of that. Do my first year on the 360 and then if they improve the xbox one version um in time for my next gm mode series so once i pick another team then i'll be recording on the xbox one obviously for oh and that was a nice goal right there oh my goodness that was a great passing play oh my that's um oh, i was just gonna go off but yeah so let me know guys honestly and um yeah, oh, I completely forget what I was going to talk about. I have so much on my mind, guys. I really, really do apologize. Kind of scattered all over the place here. But like I said, that nothing's going to change. You guys are going to be seeing the same type of videos from me this, at the same rate. All that sort of stuff. And you guys don't have to worry. So I really don't want to lose quality either. Like I said, I hate... I absolutely can't stand forcing stuff, so I'm just going to be planning out all my videos, pl play, making the thumbnails, doing all that sort of stuff, the tags, all that shit. Got to get that all out of the way, and um, I have little amount of time to do that, so I'm going to try to make the most of my weekend once in a while I can, and um, do all that stuff, and then be able to record videos. Like, oh, I just... I haven't, like, I usually, I, NHL 14, 13, I was able to put videos on the first day and then so forth. I was uploading, like, at a daily rate. NHL 15, this is my first video. I'm recording this September 13th. I mean, oh, it's just, you can't find, you gotta make most of your time. That's another thing. If you're in high school and you guys are trying to think, you guys are thinking about making a channel, you guys got to prioritize your time. I know I'm going completely off topic here, but um, I have so much on my mind and I haven't talked to you guys in so long. So um, just a quick tip to anyone just starting out in NHL 15, that, here's a huge tip. Just make sure that you put everything before your videos. I d don't want to make it sound like it's... It's bad, I think, but your experiences in high school are going to be much more valuable than just videos. You know, this is your hobby, right? And I love my hobby to death. Don't get me wrong. I am a... I am so, so happy that I have such a good and loyal fan base. Like, I came and put into words. I thank you guys so much for just watching my videos every time, regardless of any situation. I'm just so privileged. But, like I said, you got to put other things before it, right? And um, I think I want to end it here on this note, guys. Just giving you guys a little tip, I guess. Uh, but we end up winning this game 5-4 uh, last couple seconds in the third period. But uh, do you guys like the format of these videos? Like I said, like the little goal clips here and there, a little bit of gameplay. Uh, I, don't, I just don't know. I just think this is the best setup currently. But if you guys have anything better, please let me know, and I'll be more than glad to add on to the series. So once again, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video, and be sure to like, comment, subscribe, guys, for more NHL 15 videos. That is right, guys. Peace. All this attention got me hype, cut the lights, baby, this ain't only for the night, baby, this is life, uh, this is where I'm taking flight and never touching down, said it, now they know I meant it when I say we run the town.